What's up guys, it's your boy Pete, and welcome back to Planting with Pete. Now, if you're new here, this channel consists of almost everything houseplant related. That tickles your fancy. Won't you subscribe button, sit back, and enjoy the same video. Alright guys, we have made it. Oh, this looks just bad. We have made it, you guys. We have made it to, oh, there's some new leafers here. To um, Thursday. Today is Thursday. Happy Halloween to everyone. I've been trying to get this here video together for a while. Mentioned it a few couple hundred times already. And if you have a notification bell on. You definitely would know, right? Right, so today's video, you guys, we have a massive haul. And I mean massive haul, massive haul. Now, in order for me to try to keep this under, I wanted to keep this under an hour and 30 minutes, y'all. Yeah, we're going to do it. You guys seen already from the first unboxing, the begonia and stuff. I was going to, like, give you guys an overview haul thing. But if you've seen that, then you know that those are whatever. So we're not going to do that, however... Even though I do have the the begonia fur rocks right here, because I did say I was going to show you guys in the haul, which would be crazy because I do have some more plants coming. Yeah, but let's just start with what we have now. Um, throughout this whole entire summer, I've been getting plants in left and right, up and down, vertical, diagonal, obtuse, right angle. I'm enjoying it, but I'm noticing there's going to be a mess in here eventually. Um, which also will lead into another video that I want to we'll talk more about it it's in my brain I'm gonna get it I'm gonna get it together and it's gonna look how it's gonna look yeah I'm pitching it as I go but anyway we have a lot of plants to cover see y'all this is crazy this is crazy because I don't I don't know exactly what order is what but I do know I made one tropicals order save my soul being I don't know what's the matter. Well, not all of them. Not all of them. I just threw this one in here. Um, let's just start with this one, you guys. This first one is a philodendron red heart. I know it's not a frost heart. Look at these aerials. Just yummy. Yummy, gummy. Um, I've had this one, y'all. I had a lot of these things for a very, very long time. But this one just been chilling in the prop box, y'all. I'm still got to try to figure out this YouTube thing. Kids, don't come follow me right now, buddy. I love you to death, it's, but not sit right there. No, uh, 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 because you're gonna start knocking over equipment, and we're gonna fight. Ain't got time. But he do like that. He's sneak. Ain't no room, baby. We just can't do it. Um, red heart, very dark fellow. You guys, this is an upright, um, self-heading. I guess what they call it. Was that another growth? Something's going on right there. Um, I don't necessarily know if I want this. However, when I did bought it, I wanted it. Um, it's, like I said, it's a very dark very dark plant um red burgundy veining outlining shape whatever um maybe i need to i'm trying to see i got the ring light behind me you guys well behind you and let's see if i drop it low low drop drop drop, drop. Ooh, if he feet okay there we go first plant um red heart fellow Again, I may not keep her. She may end up in the, my, um, oh, I cannot sit like that until you decide not to want to cramp. But she might end up in my Etsy shop, which I can technically take her out. This is Red Heart Fellow. All right, now I do have one or two down in here that just is pure. Oh, that's what this one is. Okay, so my first order, was it this one? Yep, here we go. The, the, the plant that just gives me all types of I mean, it's new, technically. All right, but this is, <laughs> this was a spectacular philodendron, Patricia. 
those things are like just the just the pain. Here's an, the other one that we got from that haul from that um plant show we went to. Just y'all, I can't grow up a Patricia if my life depended on it. I mean, there's like this new leaf thing right here. I don't know if it's whatever. Put it back in there. But that was one of the plants. If it's a little ginger, yep, gone bye bye. All right, so the last one that's in this prop box is the um, that we got from Tropicals. Definitely not doing good. I heard that this one is a a pain, a joy pain. <laughs> um, this is the Anthurium Winlingrii, um, Elsmerata, Elsmer whatever. Yeah, Elsmera, Elsmerata. That's it. Um, not. I ain't gonna say not doing too hot, but definitely wasn't doing hot when I got it. Um, there is some baby growths there, yeah, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure, but as you can see, there is new growths growing on there. So I can close this prop box. We do have some other plants in here that we've had that's trying to do something, y'all. I don't know. They typically sit right here with that light. It's like a double header. Right there in the prop bin. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. It's okay because, like I said, we have 50, 100,000 more plants to go. Wah. All right, so let's start with the plants, y'all. So I can line these here things. I still, I know I feel like I'm going to forget something. It's all. Oh, let's start with this one. You guys seen this one? This came from the tropicals. Well, one of my first tropicals unboxing through the summer that um, when Lingria I was just seen. It came from that box. This here, what is the world? Is this stuff? Um, this here, y'all, yeah, what the thing called? Politiflorum. Yeah, in theory, Politiflorum. Hi, I got it. I'm um, doing good. Now, this one here, I mean, she's doing a lot better. She, uh, when I did get her, y'all, I said, let me just try to pile them right on up. The Politiflorum, she don't like that. She don't like that at all. These things have to be rehabbed. Um, I do love, it's kind of getting blowed out. This is darker than the other one that I do have. And you'll hear more about the Politiflorum. You'll hear more about these, y'all. And the Gladifolum. Um, once we come in here and do some purging, um, decluttering of some plants that I'm not too fond of anymore. But yeah, this is one of them. Didn't do too good with the regular shipping and the, throwing it in the pot. Nope, didn't work. Um, and it definitely wasn't going to work because they're up here now. They're now out in the growth space. So it wasn't getting that warmth and extra bright light it needed to recoup. But she's in a semi mix water. Nothing special. Um, I do feel I probably need to clean it out now. But yeah, she's been sitting here for a while just chilling after I figured out that the roots were not rooting right. So three two of them look the same that one definitely looks different um, compared to the rest all right next one let's go with a rando all right so this one here alocasia the gab christy oh we is having a complete brain fart let's jacqueline there we go i had to put it down i was going to say let's go to the next one jacqueline now this one here is not like an old i went and bought this um, if you follow, if you've seen that video, yeah, one of the previous videos, we were looking for a um, Costa Farm self-watering pot. Found it, found these on clearance, you guys. This and a Ring of Fire. Ring of Fire looked perfect. Um, but this here, Jack, and I said, well, I'm not going to buy a plant that I, that I already have. So I was like, you know, let's just get something that we don't have. Where are my shears? It looks like I'm going to be pruning while we go through these here. Whoa, through these here plants. But... Um, yeah, I said, well, I'm not going to do that, you know, so let's just get something that we don't have. And then I'm not technically taking care of this. We're going to um, deconstruct her and she's going to make her way into the pond, you know, which is going to be a whole nother, which leads into a whole nother project. I told you guys we got the, the pond light is out. All right. So I guess we're just grabbing stuff as we go. Now, this one here, <clears throat> definitely don't know the name. I got this one from my local nursery, um, Johnson's Nursery. Nursery, uh, what is this? This is something I don't want. Flower bud, too early. Um, this is a rakes begonia. Don't know what kind, you guys. There we go. Don't 
Oh, it's moving. I was going to say, what is in this pot? Is it water in there? Yep, it's water. Self-watering pot situation again. Um, don't know. Dark, begonia. Yeah, and this one's like $2. One of the youngest ones, but as you can see, she's growing. Self-watering situation. No, no biggie. Um, I think I told you guys. Have you guys told you? Have you guys told you? I don't know. I'm doing a begonia corner type situation. Um, let's go with... Should I just mix these in? I just don't want to... We're just going to pull them as we go. Next one, we have a... Let's pretend like we know what this is. Syndapsis. Um, this is one of Costa Farms releases. Syndapsis Mount Salik. Salik. Um, S-A-L-A-K. S-A-L-A-K. Yeah. Can we, are we getting anything in that? Yeah. Now, I do love the pattern. Where's the camera? Where's the ca There it is. There it is. Alright, I do love the pattern on these here things. They're gorgeous. And as you can see, we gave her one of um, my infamous pots here. And I'm currently waiting on rootage. There's plenty of moisture in there. I mean, she definitely had a nice root system, but I want to see um, healthy growing roots. But um, Syndapsis Salik of Seleke Red Day. Alright, yeah, let's get you here. Sheesh, it's a lot, y'all. Another begonia. She told y'all I went begonia crazy. This is the begonia crystalline sparkle. Now I got this here. Oh, I got this begonia during summertime. And I know it has grown a lot. Look at the fuzziness. This is, is all on the, the stems. Um, this was a Lake Joy Home Depot. Yep, one of those that you found that they're doing their thing on. Now we do have some crisp beds and stuff of that such, but as you can see by this here leaf, you guys, you can hear the texture for one, but everything on this leaf is fuzzy except for the undersides. But one freaking gorgeous plant. Um, I do love the contrast of different color greens. The new leaves come in like a dark champagne-ish kind of sitch. There it is. There it is. Kind of sitch. I love it, y'all. Hairy. Yeah, I got it for the hairiness for one, and then it was growing outside, so they had more of a autumn type situation, which I mean you can see in the leaves and in the colors and things. Maybe I go on that side. There we go. And the things, the colors of that such, but she's like freaking awesome, y'all. I'm loving it. I'm just checking out the blurriness because it does that thing. One of these days, I'm gonna take that wide screen, I mean wide lens off. So the autofocus can do what it's supposed to do. Nice white, I mean green veination up against the light. It's just, excuse me, it's just gorgeous, y'all. But crystalline begonia, we're gonna run through this. We're gonna run through this, y'all. <sighs> Let's not do another begonia because I'm about the begonia burnout. All right, so we can grab. Let's grab one of these over here. Sheesh, you know what? No, let's stay in order because once I start pulling stuff, um, here's the pot for the begonia ferox. If you're wondering, um, again, self water. I love these here better than these. You hear more about me wanting these compared to. Sorry about that. See the difference? Yeah. So we're gonna fix that. But if you're wondering. Did that work? Yeah, but going to throw rocks, y'all. There we go. Um, she did get a pot and doing good. Next, sheesh. And I don't know if she's a crawler yet because I haven't put that video out yet. So y'all, I don't know. Um, next one definitely needs another pot as well. This is my begonia escargot, escargata. Wonderful freaking plant. I think these here plants were like two dollars. I think they're on clearance, like two dollars like whatever I can get them try to save them um, we have new growth assist, so I wasn't really too worried about it and they also perked up way better than what they were before but Rex Pagonia X Gargata yeah so we're through with all those right right all right let's start with I'm always forgetting this one but this is not a new honorable mention y'all my red crystal forget it uh, yeah, I got that right. Red for Crystal. For Crystal. 
Red crystal forgetty, red stripes. Gorgeous. I always seem to forget about it when I do begonias. So I said this time begonias. Um, this time when I do my uh, my anthuriums, I was gonna mention it. All right, now we're grabbing stuff. This one here. <sighs> yeah, I wanna. <sighs> All right, so this one here. Ooh, I did not see this big old air pocket, but she is growing tons of new roots. Yeah, that's nasty air pocket. Nasty air pocket right up in there. Um, this is my Pappy Crystal Cross Crystal Hope. Y'all, when these re leaves, when these leaves here come in, they're like, can I take that out now? Yeah. I was trying to adjust the leaves. You can forcefully, semi not forcefully, um, get your leaves to grow one way. I hate looking at Ethereums that are just, you know, and it's like, you can't do nothing with your leaves facing towards the wall. And people just let them grow. Like, I don't know. To each his own, do what's work for you. But I love my plants facing the right way. Now, when we did get her, there was a little cosmotical. Some cosmotical. Uh, which was... There we go. Which is okay. It was okay. Not worried about it. root system. It was spectacular. But in the hole, here she is. Um, it comes out this nice, look at that, sheesh, um, and then it fades off into this here, which is freaking gorgeous, freaking, and even looking at the backs now, yeah, they fade down, that, that's just gorgeous, y'all, but Pappy Crystal, oh, I had it right, Pappy Crystal Hope, grab something. All right, well, you just seen this one, so I really don't have to show this too much. This is my Crystal Hope. You're not going to do too much. Wait, have you seen this one yet? Hmm, I think so. You should have. Crystal Hope. In Hoot. Um, now, these here, we have the red Gonso. Gonso or Gonso. Can, nah, I can't pronounce that, y'all. Um, the Indonesian um, form which is growing perfectly fine. Do we see any roots? No, not as of yet, but um, these are babies, so of course you won't be able to sheesh, see much on them, but there's her. Um, what else do we have, y'all? We also have, oh, well, I guess I got to show you those updates too, whatever. Um, ooh, looking a little rough here, baby. Um, yes. Worse for wear, y'all. We have the um, Dark, Dark Block Cross, Dark Phoenix Goliath. Um, there were some fresh looking <laughs> roots, but there may have been a slight um, underwater, which I'm okay with. Um, but this is she. Let's go with the best looking leaf at this point. There we go. There we go. Gorgeous. Um, as you can see, there is some damage there, but underwater and then, you know, flooded. So there's that. But yeah, little baby there. Um, I'm trying to make sure I remember to put these back in their <laughs> spots because this is just going to be one of those days. All right, so this one here is the Silver Tiger Cross Clarendervium. Definitely has been growing. Um, I couldn't say if like these are all fast growers because I don't pay them no attention. So it don't mean that they're growing and I'm not paying them any attention. Don't see any like extravagant, okay, per like extravagant roots, but sheesh. Um, again, you're not miss, you're not missing, you're not seeing much. There we go. But you can see the clary coming in there. Um, that's, yeah, Silver Tiger, Carl, Cross, Clarinervium. There's too many of these to try, oh, y'all, sorry. There's too many of these to try to put pictures, so we're definitely not doing that. But a lot of these, you definitely should know what they look like. Silver Tiger, just think of a silver. In theory, you know, I love me a good old silver. In theory, sheesh, I have a lot going on here. Okay, next plant, we have the Velvet Maria, or Moria. Um, this is the Pappy uh, Sucks Ignatum Cross. Again, another one. Oh, oh she, she, she has spectacular roots. Can we get in there real quick? 
Yeah, we're gonna get this. Uh, there we go. You see all those roots? She got good roots. This is she. Let's do that. There we go. Gorgeous. That's better that way. Yeah. Um, some leaf. Oh, I ain't see the dang on new leaf. We got a new leaf right there, y'all. Again, I don't pay these things. No, never mind. They just sit down there and they root and they do their thing. Um, yeah, I got this one from the dark foliage. And, of course, the leaf shape. And if you got that, I don't know how that's going to work because you won't be able to get that tropicals. So should I just wait to show you guys what was in that? Yeah, I'm going to have to wait on that tropicals because you guys will get this video before that tropicals unboxing. The new tropicals unboxing. So, mental. That's, those are the ones that are up there. So that's fine. Um, let's grab another one. Now this one here, <coughs> excuse me. These are my Ethereum's um, Ace of Spades, Bebes, no new roots, but, okay, no new roots, but she got two new leaves, there are two plants in here, so there should only be two new growth points, but I'm seeing three, but more than likely, you guys, this one is probably going to be a um, giveaway, because I'm thinking if I want like a real big ace of space i'll just get one so uh we're gonna do these giveaways once they beef up a little bit more and then also once the weather changes, y'all because you know i'm not shipping in like three degrees across the map if you do win but ace of space endo form um what can we grab everything got the stage right all right so we do have some Let's make sure. Yeah. Crystal Hope. Yeah. All right. So we did that Crystal Hope video. Um, we do have that little baby that we propped off of that Crystal Hope, which is the one you just seen in the beginning. Um, we do have a Silver Blush Cross Spaghetti open. Um, she said it could be. I hope. I really hope it was um, open with a, um, what is that? The Esmeralda. War Korean Esmeralda. But it's war it could be the Queen Esmeralda. She said it was something else. And two more whatever ones. But that's the only one that caught my eye. Um, you guys won't be able to see much. These are really, really seedling. So, yeah. And then I also have a Pure Silver Tiger. Right? Yeah, Pure Silver Tiger Seed. Um, and they both, both of these are giving the weeds. And as you can see, they're itty bitty. Itty bitty. Would I buy itty bitty? No, no, no. That's definitely just too much going on. Next, we have the Ethereum. I forgot what she said. Um, the pants were, but it's AA024012. Not sure, but it's definitely getting um, the Vein Nation and stuff in it. It wasn't there before when I got it, which was like Uber. But yeah definitely gonna grow this one out and see what she's gonna give y'all yeah it's gonna be interesting trying to put all this stuff back okay um let's grab one from the bottom all right there's this one this one is the anthurium dot block f2 cross dark forgetty sheesh um another oh with another new leaf okay nice chunky roots i'm sorry i'm looking at it i don't touch these at all I barely even bother them nice roots somewhere up in there right there um but yeah this is the dot block dark forgetty dot block f2 cross dark forgetty now, this is a gorgeous behind plant y'all can you get that can you can you get that newest leaf coming in um she's in one of my self watering pots if you're wondering Trying to tighten this up some, but gorgeous, y'all. Got some leaves that may go. Again, that was that crazy dry cycle then blasted with low water. But they're doing good. I love it. I freaking love it. I cannot wait to um, this one grows out just like the rest. Where's the front? There it is. I try to keep the watering part towards the front. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so we can grab now this one 
Ugh. You know what? Let's go here. Ugh. Now this one came in rough conditions. As you can see, the damage. It was kind of waterlogged. It was just a mess. But um, this is my Ethereum Night Fox. That's a crystalline across um, GG. <clears throat> Newest leaf that came in in my possession. Gorgeous. There we go. You see the darkness on it, but the light, like up in there, but the light is kind of shimmering in and out. Oh, she's like freaking gorgeous, y'all. Let me move my face. Let's try it again. There it goes. But she's gorgeous. Eventually, what I'm going to do is I want it when I got her. You guys, I did a quick repot. Well, not maybe a quick, maybe a day or so. A day at most. Um, and I got her to her situation, and we're growing. I see new roots. Which is why I was waiting to, before I come back through and just, because all this has to go. And then she's going to be a one leafer in this big old pot situation. So, yeah, Anthurium Night Fox, which is the crystal linum cross with the Nunger Laminum GG. Freaking gorgeous. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the ones that you're seeing in the glass, you guys, they're sitting those are the ones that were missing that are sitting on the um the tv on the tv on the stand or the entertainment thing sorry about that this is a pepe what is it pepe crystal crystal hope that thing is gorgeous y'all it reminds me of like a sophisticated uh ethereum what are those things called do you need water no ethereum um King, yeah, King of King, H U, yeah, yeah. Anyway, um, did we just do a big one? Yeah, that's it. And she is gorgeous, y'all. Anyway, let's grab another one. We can't do the ones at the top, so we have two, four. Oh, we flew through this. Two, four, six. We have six plants left. I'm so good. Hopefully, this is a. Oh, oh, hopefully this is on the thirty minutes. If this is, oh my goodness, yeah. It takes me 30 minutes to record, but I got to edit all these names in there. Some, right? Next plant, we have the Anthurium SKG Gray Cross Node. Um, node. <laughs> no ID. Gorgeous. New leaf just emerged here. There we go. She's gorgeous, y'all. Um, do we have any? You should have some roots. Yeah, I see some red. Up in there, but gorgeous plant. Uh oh, there we go. There we go. And again, newest leaf. You definitely can tell. Can't wait till it continues to grow. I'm gonna keep an eye on these little things. They've been growing, shedding leaves, pushing out leaves, and interesting. Very interesting. But again, SKG, um, gray cross, no ID. So, yeah gorgeous right yeah I should have went like in a certain type of way because I don't even know how these small ones um, get back in here I catch it when I take them out and have to do a major watering now this one I don't know if I'm going to keep or not um, it's a yellowing leaf let's go ahead and get to this is the John um, Baina no ID Tim Anderson crystal black yeah, a lot going on with the name. Just, but we have crazy roots, so crazy roots. But a lot going on with the name. Here it is. Here she is, the newest leaf. Let's give you a one, two. Let's check and make sure. Oh right, yeah, so this is the newest leaf here. So again, now the one thing that I don't like about, um, if you can't pick out your own plant, then um, typically. The nursery would definitely keep the best, best looking um, offspring. I mean, smartest thing to do, right? But yeah, this one is more like a, it's given like, not simple, because I've seen uh, my crystal, my mag, yeah, I think crystal sieve, I think that's what it is. Uh, what her name? Jasmine got one. That thing looks so good. That thing looks so, her, her veining. Um, I don't know what the hell it is, 
I mean, of course, they all not the same, even though they're the same. But however, it's given crystal silver. I think that's my crystal mag silver over there I'm looking at. Um, but yeah, I don't know if we're going to get keep it or not. But I do think this is one of the ones that get a little bit bigger. Um, but yeah, John Banner. Um, no ID, cost 10 minutes in crystal black. Self watering pot. One of the first ones I got, I think, during the summertime. If I'm not mistaken. And a lot of these, you guys, we got from trades from a lot of the stuff out of the out of the shop. So, yeah. Uh, which came from a lot of you guys as well. Uh, I'm sorry I messed with the Begonia Ferox. Sheesh. Alright, we're almost through. We're almost through. Let's grab one of my top joys. This is my HU King. Ethereum King. This is... Okay, I don't know, y'all, because when I got it, it was already kind of sketchy. It was already kind of sketchy how they had it wrapped, you know. But I do come in here and I kind of squeeze the pot and make sure some extra air get through it. But she's been green. There, there was a root. I mean, yeah, it's not rooting anymore because it was looking a little iffy. But this is my HU. And we're going to hope it looks a little pregnant, but we're going to hope, you know, for the best. These things are not cheap, right? At all. At all, right? I got this for a good price. Sherry know. <laughs> Sherry know about all these implants. I thank all of them. I be forgetting sometimes. But, yeah, Ethereum, HU, King, King, King. Why well, do I want to call it King? All right, so we have two more, three more. We have three small ones. Let's go with this one. Yeah, let's go with this one. Yeah, because I can't show the other one. This is the Dark Beauty. Black Beauty. Um, this is the cross. I don't know, but we're going to Black Beauty F1. Um, I guess. Oh, this one is not a quick drinker or where are you sitting at the bottom? We're gonna figure out. This is the only one that has juice at the bottom. Very strange. Very strange. But anyway, um, let's check. Oh yeah, she got roots. She got roots. Um, but yeah, Black Beauty. Freaking gorgeous. And I mean gorgeous. And of course, you know this light. Once I figure out the light, y'all, we're gonna be on. It's just. It's dark. <laughs> it is dark. I wonder, like, maybe if, how do you do the YouTube thing? Anyway, but she's doing good, y'all. I do love it. It has, like, this red around the margins. You definitely can see the darkness in that. But gorgeous. Freaking gorgeous. Gorgeous. Black Beauty. What was this one at the bottom? Yeah, we might switch you out switch some of y'all out. Alright, um, so the next one we're going to do, since I'm switching this out, put you at the top. Yeah. Yeah. Which I don't know, y'all, because they've been growing in their situations. So I don't want them too much. Alright, so we got one small one and one big one left. Now, this one I'm a little upset. We got this one towards the, this one was like the summer. Um, Tropicals Hall. This is the Ethereum Bessier AFF Silver. Freaking gorgeous, y'all. Freaking gorgeous. Now, this one, this one leaf was already acting iffy. It's fine. It's like an indicator. Um, now, what really upset me is because we had another. Oh, well, this one died off too. We had a growth point that was pushing out a new leaf, but I couldn't wait, y'all. And so I took it outside to switch it into this. And I don't, it could have been the combination of it just being cold, really cold at night. Um, yeah, and then also the combination of just having a new leaf. But anyway, she looks freaking good. I mean, she looks stunning. I mean, it has been some damage. I don't know if that's continuing. Could have been there. Don't know. But looks freaking good. One of the elder leaves. And again, like I said, she had a growth point 
too. Matter of fact, it just 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 not there, you know. Um, did I say I see any? I mean, the roots look good, but I don't see any. Look at me now, roots, you know. But Ethereum Bessier, um, AF LF, LF Mental P Silver, gorgeous. I can't wait to get this thing growing how it's supposed to. And this room is just going to be Ethereum down, like I'm telling y'all. Uh, was that it? No, we have one more. This one, last but not least, we have the Ethereum Berry Swartz um, Jungle Giant Cross Zara Michelle. Gorgeous. We have a new leaf. Well, y'all are witnessing another. Well, y'all are what y'all are witnessing a new leaf, not another new leaf. I'm looking at something down here. What is that? What's that poking? There's some poking right there. What it is, y'all? I know there ain't no flower unless it's gonna spread, but. Sorry about that. This is a new leaf. I don't know what you can. This thing. There we go. This is the new leaf on her. Freaking gorgeous, y'all. Gorgeous. Previous leaves. Are we getting that? Yeah. Yeah. Blush is like a, a smidge of pink that runs through the vein nation. Of course, the silver. Yeah, I'm gonna love this here plant. And it looks like she's spreading. You probably won't be able to see that. Yeah, I think she's gonna double head herself, bushel out, newly. But Barry Schwartz, Zara Michelle, Jungle Giant Cross. That is crazy. Oh, look at that. We got a root. Oh, uh, not that ain't a good thing. Um, so I guess on my next maintenance video. I'm going to be up potting these. Maybe. No. Definitely, I'm not going to do that. That's just too much work. I'm going to say up pot them to this. It's just not going to happen, y'all. So, um, we do have bigger nursery pots just for this situation. That once they get to that size, then we switch them out into the um, bigger glass pots that you guys do see. But, y'all, I don't know what's the, um, the time that we hit. But I know it's under an hour. It got to be under 30 minutes. Cause there's no, I didn't really do any crazy things for me to edit, so it, it we're gonna see, <laughs> we're gonna see. Hopefully everyone is doing good. I probably should have told you at the beginning of the video to grab your snacks, your beer. Let's just hope, you know, a lot of us are already smart and we either pause the video or we have this stuff ready and prepared. But yeah, a lot of these here plants, y'all, I couldn't tell you. I could, I might do a separate video on my top ten. Out of out of the massive haul that we just did, I don't know how many plants that was. Somebody let me know down in the comment section below, because right now and right here in my eyesight, I don't even nope. I'm not even looking back. We got two, four, six, eight, ten. We got twelve just right here. Yeah, one. And then y'all ain't even seen some of the ones at the top yet, so I can't even put that in the video. But just know that video, those plants would have been added here as well. But guys. That is it for today's video. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Now the next video is um, concerning in here. I'm going to show you guys where they're housed in, uh, which will correlate into decluttering and all this other stuff. Just a gateway um, that'll lead me straight into a lot of other things. Now if I don't do this stuff on camera, then I'll do like I did my um, walkthrough before changes video, whatever we're going to call that. I'm just going to show you guys and then do a video later on sometime and show you what was done. But that is it. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Um, like I said, I might do a top 10. Um, trying to get all these back. I guess we can chitter. Uh, I want to do a top 10, you guys, on exactly well, my top 10 plants, right? Um, that we got from the haul. Again, which is crazy. Uh oh, sorry about that. Which is crazy. So I do have a lot of babies uh, that we're gonna be working with, y'all. Uh, mostly in theriums throughout the growth seasons, future future growth seasons. But yeah, I need to get all this stuff back in here. Oh my feet. Oh. Oh, and then I have to take some of these plants. Did that thing just turn yellow? Oh no, it, it caught the light. 
Let's see, why is my screen that color? But, guys, that's it. That's it. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. If you'd like to support the channel, you guys. So there's this little heart thing down there. Just say super thanks just to say, hey, thank you. Uh, or thank me <laughs> for um, whatever you're thanking me for. And, yeah, $2, $4, $1,000, 6000000 whatever you give, you guys. I promise you I will be grateful <clears throat> and thankful for it. Um, if you can't do that, I also have Etsy Shop. Go and give me Etsy Shop a follow. Um, and then make sure you um, um, check out some of the plans. I'm trying to get these back how they were. It was a big one somewhere I'm missing. Was it this one, Barry? Barry said at the top. Yeah, I have plants in there. On there. However you going to call it. Um, if you don't see anything and know that I have something, just do an inquiry. Um, either through Insta or um, even better over on Etsy. That definitely works, but yeah, that's it. I'm trying to get all these babies back where they were. Oh, which is going to be interesting. These small ones, and I have to. It's just a lot. It's a lot. Oh, hey. I'm getting old, y'all. But yeah, like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'm gonna cut these here lights bone back on as you can see. So I'm not messing up anything. These babies are gorgeous, y'all. They're gorgeous. They're freaking gorgeous. Um and then also I'll tell you guys, like I said about the setup, um, about the lighting, things of that such. But like, comment, share, and subscribe. Um, what is going on here? Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Sheesh. Um, I need to get these back in here as you can see we finna have it out over here and yeah I need to get this video up and edit it before let me stop talking because it's gonna make it longer make it harder to edit so yeah guys we're out let me know out of all the plants that you've seen let me know your top three your top three maybe that are on your wish list it probably don't even have to be on your wish list or maybe just the plant that you want I know how that is you see it and you want it you know that be me sometimes I, I definitely there we go I definitely can relate to that but let me know in the comment section below um, and again make sure you are subscribed make sure notification bell is on as well keep you notified and there's no peak got going on over here you feel me there we go. I'm trying to make this make sense but it's making it hard to make sense but um, I'm out guys <laughs> bye